there were a large number of problems with the somatic mutation theory, although we didn't see it at the time. First, the cancer is not genetically homogenous. So that's a big problem because if you have one clone through the whole thing, that is fine, except that we know for a fact that this primary tumor has a bunch of subclones in it. If you look at metastases, it has a completely different mutations. If you look at lymph nodes, anything. The second problem was that how is it possible that if these cells are getting new mutations and they're random mutations, how come every cancer looks the same? You have a hundred different people whose cancers have mutated completely differently, independent of each other. And yet everybody with that stage two colon cancer looks exactly precisely the same. It doesn't make any sense at all.